Now we're at the command center and at our supply center. And what you need to know is when I arrived here, um, they had already started cleaning it up, but there was like four inches of mud in there and everything had been underwater. When you go into the church, you'll see that the slab is very uneven. The slab actually floated. Um, it's important to know the amount of work that has gone in and the baby steps we've had to take. We were, it was definitely like the Wild West when we got here. I mean, we were just in crisis mode and just everybody was just trying to survive. Um, and everybody has given so much time and energy without time off in days to be able to get this to where it is um, with the cobbled amount of supplies and things that we've had um, to get everything up and running. It's very difficult. All this has been cleaned up. I mean, this was all debris, all debris. Jamie Bethel got us a generator so that we're able to run two buildings. We now have our own fuel supply there that was donated by, by uh, Tommy Turnin. Uh, 